Hello and welcome to Marsh Industries Tea Break Training. I'm Michael Harrison. This is our series that looks at the range of products that we offer and the issues that surround them within the, the industry. Um, today we are going to look at the General Binding Rules 2020 and their impact on the septic tanks. So if you want to look at any of our previous videos, don't forget they're available on our website under the Tea Break Training page where all accompanying resources are available throughout the, the series. So the General Binding Rules 2020 um, and septic tank compliance. So the environmental permitting rules set up for England and Wales came into force originally on the 1st of January 2015. Um, so general binding rules were created for septic tanks, um, small packaged sewage treatment plants for, for domestic use. And the rules are designed to reduce the level of pollution from sewage that was entering the, the nation's watercourses. So under the new general binding rules, the update from the 1st of January 2020, a date that has now passed, if you have a septic tank that discharges directly to surface water, so for instance a, a water ditch, a stream, a, a river, you must upgrade or replace your septic tank to a full sewage treatment plant system by the 1st of January 2020. That date's now passed, so as soon as possible. So the previous methods allowed for discharging wastewater from septic tanks were um, through a network of pipes into a drainage field in surrounding subsoils, which would provide an additional form of treatment. And this is still allowed and compliant. So if you have a septic tank discharged into a drainage field, you are fine and you are compliant. If you have a septic tank discharging to surface water, you are not compliant. So if you fall into the latter there, um, what are your options? There are four options. And the first is connect to the main sewer. Generally, if you've got a septic tank in your garden or at your property, it means that there isn't a main sewer available nearby. But potentially in the, the intervening years since the property was built, there may have been more infrastructure added to the local area. So upgrades to local infrastructure or new housing estate developments. And it may be possible to actually connect um, onto to that uh, system that might require one of our pump stations so please feel free to talk to us about that if that is your scenario. Option two is to install a drainage field um, designed in accordance with BS6297. As I said before this allows the septic tank to discharge wastewater into the ground instead of the surface water so that's the key differential. Um, but to do that you would need to have space to install a drainage field and have um, a little good percolation rate for water draining away through the, the, the surrounding land so not be on top of um, heavy rock or clay or a high water table. A third option which we'll come into in more detail today is to install a Marsh Industries Unigem septic conversion unit which can be installed and connected to a pre-existing septic tank and allows for treatment of the wastewater coming from that septic tank. And lastly, the final option is to uh, remove the septic tank and install a Marsh Industries enzyme sewage treatment plant. So if you want to refer back to module one, we're talking greater depth around how the, the enzyme unit works. And that would be compliant with EN 12566 part three. So let's take a further look at the um, Unigem now, so option three and how that works in this uh, given scenario. So again, the environmental permitting regulations came into force in 2015, creating the general binding rules for septic tanks and domestic use. These were updated in 2020, stating that septic tanks can no longer discharge directly to surface water and needed to be upgraded or replaced by 1st January 2020. The cost-effective solution to do this is our Marsh Unigem Star. This is a CE-approved septic conversion unit. It converts a polluting septic tank into a fully functioning packaged sewage treatment plant and is compliant with EN 12566 part six. The unit can be positioned behind any existing septic tank with a Unigem star treating the discharge to an effluent quality that reaches and exceeds national requirements, meaning that the final effluent can be discharged safely to a river, ditch or running watercourse. course. 
So how does this unit work? The septic tank allows suspended solids to be separated and form into a sludge with the draining effluent then transferring into the Unigem star unit where it enters the aeration chamber and the air diffuser pushes compressed air through the chamber to treat the effluent, which then flows to a final settlement chamber before being safely discharged to a river, ditch or watercourse. So what are the key benefits of the Unigem star? It eliminates the need for removing and replacing an old tank or building a drainage field. It complies with environmental and building regulation requirements. And it offers outstanding effluent quality with discharges well within national consent standards. It provides a space saving solution for sites and where minimal disruption surrounding obstructions is required. This is the obvious choice. This low energy compressor ensures minimal running, maintenance and servicing costs and it's tested and proven to be suitable for all ground conditions 12 months of the year. It has integral lifting eyes for improved on-site handling, which also offers quick and easy installation, providing cost savings as well as health and safety benefits. The keying and lips in assist in the anchoring into the concrete surround, and the unit offers simple and safe access for ongoing maintenance and cleaning. It's available in horizontal and vertical models, with invert risers and pumped outlets also available to tailor the units to the particular site conditions. So there are three options for the Unigem star. The SCS, which pairs up with shallow cylindrical septic tanks, and the SPH, which works with the onion-shaped septic tank. And lastly, the option to buy a new septic tank and Unigem star and install those two items at a convenient location. So if you have a requirement for any of those scenarios, please feel free to contact our sales office or our sales team. We're available to meet in person on site over the phone or via video conferencing. And don't forget all the videos in our series are available on our webpage. And I look forward to seeing you again next time. Thank you for your time. <laughs>